boycott. I mean, I think the academic and cultural boycotts, and this was true in South Africa too, particularly the sports, sports boycott. In many ways, it is a symbolic boycott. However, and I think this is really important, we're anthropologists. I think we have to think seriously about the symbolic not being tethered to the word merely. Um, the reality is that the boycott has opened, I think Lisa mentioned this, has opened more conversation and debate about the state of Israel-Palestine today in U.S. society than I have seen since I moved here about 25 years ago. It has that force. It has the force of saying there is something not okay going on here. We need to recognize it, we need to talk about it, and we need to force the U.S. government and public to do something about it. So on that level, it is symbolic, but the symbolic has material force here.